Your WCBI First Alert AccuWeather Forecast with meteorologist Trevor Burchett. Not a whole lot of weather going on in the United States. I don't think we're going to have many complaints about that. Really, all we have to talk about right now is a little bit of cloud cover in the Midwest, maybe some showers in the UP of Michigan, also some rain up near Seattle. But we're going to turn our attention to the next big weather system, and that's what this little swirl is off here uh, to the west of Los Angeles. That's a low pressure system that is eventually going to bring us the chance for rain by the end of the week and the weekend. No rain out there right now. As a matter of fact, take a look at this. Frosty the snowman himself, the world famous, is watching over downtown Columbus this evening. He's bundled up and for good cause because it is cold out there. Temperatures already down into the 30s in most locations. We're 34 in Starkville and in Columbus, 38 degrees in Tupelo right now, 34 in Aberdeen, 39 in West Point under a mostly clear sky. The cooler weather will continue for the rest of this evening. It's going to be cold tomorrow morning once again. Lows in the low 30s, 31 in Columbus, 30, or 31 I should say in Tupelo as well. Mostly clear skies, but I do think we have the chance for a little bit of morning fog tomorrow. Now the best chance for this is going to be if you live in a low-lying area or if you live near a lake or a river, especially near the Tintom. Look at this model picking up some of that fog there in Lowndes County down into Pickens County. That's the river, and so we could have some fog around there. So if you take the bridge on 82 tomorrow morning, keep that in mind. Also, uh, up near Tupelo on 45, that area tends to be a little foggy as well. Just keep that in mind. Use your low beam headlights. Regardless, any fog should be gone by 9 a.m. The rest of the day is going to be beautiful sunshine. Blue sky all through the day. Warmer, too, with those southwesterly winds helping to push in some warmer air for us. 65 degrees for the high tomorrow afternoon. And I mentioned that low pressure system off California. Watch what happens to it. We're going to put this into motion into the future. It comes on shore and picks up some more moisture from the Gulf. And I think by Friday night into Saturday, we have the chance to see some rain here in our neck of the woods. Fortunately, we're not expecting any severe weather, but some rain certainly likely. The best chance for this is going to be late Friday after sunset through the morning on Saturday. So 9 p.m. Friday, likely still not seeing rain. Better chances for rain by 9 a.m. into lunchtime on Saturday and then hopefully drying out by Saturday afternoon. If all goes well, we will be dry on Sunday. Still a little bit of a question mark on that part of the forecast, though. Rainfall amounts generally less than a half an inch. But beautiful weather here for the next several days. Sunshine Wednesday, Thursday, a few more clouds on Friday. Again, that rain's going to hold off until after sunset. Friday looks dry. Rainy Saturday, cooler by the beginning portion of next week.